Hey everybody, how you doing? Today is Sunday, the 31st of January. Uh, it is the end of the month, which means that February is tomorrow. And with February brings Mobile Beat Las Vegas 2010. So, a number of you are already going or planning on going. And those who have yet to decide or are still on the fence, uh, it's not too late. You can still uh, make it out there. It's going to be a good time. Uh, there's going to be a lot of uh, good things happening, a lot of uh, sharing of ideas, uh, new friendships, networking, so on and so forth. And, uh, you know, just wanted to give some of the new guys that are going to be going there. Uh, mind you, I'm no expert. This is really only my second year, but uh, what I found worked great for me last year uh, was that one, you'd have to have, uh, you know, bring comfortable shoes. You may, you may end up doing a lot of walking uh, in and around the seminar, the exhibit halls and whatnot, back and forth to your hotel room. Uh, this is just during the day. You know, and what happens at night is another question. So, uh, make sure you bring comfortable footwear. Um, uh, just have a good idea, have a good open mind. Uh, don't be afraid to ask any questions from uh, either people you don't know or people you do know uh, that you do meet up there because I'm sure we will meet up. We are going to see each other. We are going to be in a few photos. Okay, so yeah. Uh, just taking some time now to uh, finalize the plan. I got my suitcase over there uh, already looking at packing. Uh, getting stuff ready for uh, next week and it's going to be an interesting uh, weekend that weekend of February 6th we've got uh, UFC 109 happening we've got the Super Bowl on Sunday and a lot of people are going to be trickling into Las Vegas on Sunday and the Monday for uh, the Mobile Beat show that week so there's a lot of things to think about you know, one of other few things I want to remind you, if you are coming and bringing a laptop, don't forget your charger. And, uh, you know, if you're coming overseas, you might want to bring an adapter to convert the type of plug or what have you to for the North American style outlets and such. And it also goes for your video cameras, cell phones, or any other electronic devices. Yes, you can probably buy them, but, you know... Or replace them if you forget them, but that's a, but that's something that you can avoid if you just uh, do a little planning ahead. Okay. Um, as well, a good thing to have with you is USB drives. You never know when you're going to need them, and always good to have uh, for sharing information with with uh, uh, fellow DJs and such. And what's better than a USB drive is portable external hard drive. You know, nice three and a half inch drive, you know, 160 gig, no big deal, right? Because you never know what you're going to find, what you're going to share, what you're going to get. So it's good to be prepared. You know, you may not always uh, have an opportunity to, uh, you know, fit everything on a two or four or eight or 16 gig uh, USB drive. So be ready. You know what I mean? So, as well, if you are traveling, um, you may find this in your luggage. I don't know if you can catch that. It is a Transportation Security Administration notification of baggage check. Yes, you may get one. Don't be scared. It just means they look through your luggage and uh, check to make sure that to see if uh, uh, your underwear fit them, you know, in case they need an extra pair I want to check for any uh, contraband of some sorts or whatever, but it's nothing. It's all love. It's all good. You know, making sure that everything is safe, everyone's safe, and, you know, making sure that your trip to uh, the U.S. is uh, an enjoyable one. So, yeah, don't worry if you get one of those. You know, I've had them all the time. No big deal. It all happens to, every, it all happens to us one, or, one time or another. Uh, those of us flying outside of the U.S. into the U.S. may uh, get an extra warm feeling at the airports upon our entry for uh, security reasons as well. I know I will, and most likely I will. I know that for sure. I'm, I'm usually um, 
let's say, what's the nice word to say, uh, requested to be part of that extra security check. So I'm used to it. I did do a lot of uh, traveling to the U.S., so it happens to me all the time. So I'm, I'm not worried. It's okay. It's all love. No haters. <laughs> it's all good to me. So, uh, yeah, no, just uh, go come to Mobile Beat if you can. If not, make plans for coming out next year. And you are going to be there this year. Look for me. Say hi. We'll take a picture. You know, we'll, uh, we'll shoot the breeze. We'll do whatever. See you in a seminar. See you at the one of the few after parties at the uh, top of the riv. And uh, maybe see you at the poker tournament. So, yeah, that's just go there, be there, meet people, get to know, get ideas, share ideas, give some ideas. Have an open mind. You know what? Make a friend or two. Network. Get to know some of your other, uh, other fellow DJs and other fellow YouTube DJs. All right? Thanks for watching. Practice. And enjoy.